welcome 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 today we're going to be talking about spring and summer essentials according to me these are essentials according to me i'm going to be dividing these into different categories it is very essential according to me the whole video is according to me actually every video i've ever made is according to me it's my opinion you don't have to take it as important you don't have to take it as a fact at all so because we already don't have enough clothes to play with we cannot layer them i mean we can but you have to be very very smart about it so the best way to basically elevate your outfit during summers is by accessorizing the most important accessory that immediately elevates any outfit i believe is sunglasses alert glasses like these look so cool instantly spice up an outfit they make it more interesting more fun more summery i need to stop doing this why do i keep doing this but yeah these are really cool i got these from amazon for like i think 400 or 350 something they're really cheap and they're so nice such good quality as well i have a few more types of sunglasses these which i don't look good in and in the same style we have these again spice up your outfit immediately it looks so cool and chic or if you want to be subtle and not go too crazy with colors and everything you can go for something like this a different design something a little funner from just a square or a rectangle glass but this still really safe and chic and these are in brown add a little bit of color but still nothing too crazy i don't know how to talk about things i don't know if i'm doing a good job i don't think i am but i hope you get the idea I've always said that i'm and i'm going to continue saying that you can never go wrong with sunglasses okay i've already talked enough about sunglasses i hope you get the point moving on to jewelry these are the beaded necklaces that i made they're very easy to make but you can also get them very easily if you don't want to make them this is just a very fun colorful beaded necklace these are very light and so fun like you can play around with them you can layer them it's a very fun summer activity activity what am i saying it's a very fun summer accessory again easily just makes the outfit much more interesting also beaded rings come on i also made a matching bracelet uh, of this necklace so you know something fun like this just a cord set jewelry moment that's not a word i'm just making shit up at this point and some fun beaded necklace what is it? it's not a necklace some fun beaded bracelets like these just you get it okay you get it so fun beaded jewelry is the way to go during summers get some have fun with them you can't go wrong another accessory is caps because it's summer baby i don't look good with a cap on so i don't really wear them this is the only cap i own throw on a cap or a hat and it will give you sun protection but at the same time make your outfit more interesting to look at last accessory i want to talk about are bags okay this bag it's my pride and joy this is a bag from when i was i think 9 or 10 years old and i found it recently and i haven't stopped using it since come on it is so precious and it is so fun for summer some interesting bags like these beaded crochet bags or you can have fun with the colors it's summer baby get out of your comfort zone throw on a little fun colored bag with your white and blue basic outfit again or you can just throw a fun colored sling bag it will never fail you it is fun but it is also very useful and you don't have to carry it everywhere you can just throw it on and walk around freely because it's summer you're having fun you get it so basically get some fun accessories if you're comfortable experiment with colors and shapes and sizes and make it more interesting best summer hack ever trust me source trust me bro okay finally moving on to the next category which is skin care and makeup if there's one summer essential you want to take from this video it has to be a sunscreen sunscreen is so important not only during summers but throughout the year every single day you have to put a sunscreen on i'm sure by this point we understand the importance of sunscreen 
but if you don't then allow me to traumatize you by this picture of a 92 year old woman who applied sunscreen regularly on her face but not on her neck this picture literally haunts me i'm not kidding the sunscreen i've been using recently is this one it's the chic nutrix block lightweight sunscreen I have been using this for over a week now just to test it out. The most important thing that I look for while hunting for a sunscreen is the SPF level. It has to be at least 45, no less than that, which this sunscreen has. It has SPF 45 and also PA triple plus. It is for all skin types, which I appreciate a lot. Also, this is made in Korea. So that already gave me assurance even before I started using it. One of my favorite things about this sunscreen is its applicator. It comes in this concentrated nozzle, so the product doesn't burst out everywhere. It comes out very smoothly and I use the three finger application obviously the sunscreen contains niacinamide which we know is all the rage recently it basically aids in calming irritated skin and maintains hydration it also has adenosine which promotes cell generation improves skin elasticity and wrinkles it has spf 45 with pa triple plus which provides extra protection against harmful sun rays and prevents sun damage it is silicone and paraben free non-greasy lightweight and leaves no white cast as you can see it blends very smoothly oh and don't forget the neck. This is also such good timing because Chic New Tricks just turned four. Happy birthday, Chic New Tricks. There will be biggest sales offers all throughout the month of May along with assured gifts and rewards with every single order. Avail my code CHICAMIA10 for additional 10% off over all of these amazing sale discounts already going on. It's a win-win-win situation throughout. You cannot lose. So another extremely essential product after sunscreen for me is lip balm. You want your lips to be juicy and hydrated during summers. For me, especially, it's very important. I am addicted to lip balm, by the way. Most effective and cost-efficient lip balm is Vaseline. Again, you can never go wrong. Another lip balm that I really like is the Body Shop Bon Lippy lip balm. This one is in the shade Raspberry Frambose. And this is also on its way out. I use it a lot. It has such a nice dreamy scent, although it does not taste as good. I mean, I've not eaten it, but sometimes it gets in your mouth, okay? That's how I know it. I've not eaten it. Also tints, they are very lightweight. They provide you with that flush of color that you need during summers. This is the one that I have. Its label has come off. But I got this one in a fair from a small business. I use this every day. I love this tint. And if you want that extra juicy and plum effect, lip glosses and lip plumpers. Lip plumper I use is the infamous Too Faced Lip Injection Extreme. Okay, oh my god. And the lip gloss that I use is the Swiss beauty kiss candy lip balm with olive oil i usually apply this over my lipstick for the extra shine and it's basically a lip gloss but it is so nice it is so good and it is for 99 rupees and there's always discounts going on so i think i got this for 65 or 67 rupees which is insane i'm going to get 20 of these i'm not kidding i will forever use this i love it so much if you want a cheaper brand recommendation for makeup Try Swiss Beauty or Wet n Wild. Not Pumps. Another summer essential. Another summer essential. This is the chemist at play underarm roll on. This is the one I use, but basically any underarm roll on. This is so nice though, and it also, I have noticed, has made my underarms lighter. I'll take it. If you want a roll on, I would definitely recommend this one. Try it out. Another summer essential. Dry shampoo, I use the infamous Batiste dry shampoo again. This is nice, although I wish there was a, I don't know. I think there might be a better alternative, but this is a nice one if you want to try it out. Not that bad, does the job. So yeah, dry shampoo to beat the summer heat. Another beat the heat product, sheet mask. I like this one, Lacme, but you can use any sheet mask, I think. They do the job. It provides hydration, refreshment to your face. You need it, especially during summers. And I think even during the whole year. Sheet masks are really nice. They're fun. I think light just died on me. 
I don't know if you can tell the difference, but that is what happened. It's okay. We keep moving. We keep chilling. We keep winning. Okay, moving on to makeup products. Maybelline Fit Me Tint or any face tint. I think they are so nice. They're light. They provide a little coverage. If you need a lighter coverage, tints are the best way to go. Especially during summer, you don't want to feel like you have a lot on your face or a lot going on because you want to get in the water. You want to run around have fun and also the heat is going to be melting your makeup off the reason why i really like this tint is because it also has spf in it i mean you obviously need to apply sunscreen that is that's a no-brainer it is a necessity you have to apply sunscreen but on top of that a little more sunscreen never hurt anyone so this is a nice extra layer of sunscreen being added it's very very important to have a hydrated skin so a hydrating serum is another summer essential for me this is the innisfree green tea seed serum although this is quite i think this retails for 900 and all i've seen it do is basically yeah i mean it is a moisture barrier strengthening solution it's basically a hydrating serum if you're willing to invest in it this is really nice there's no issue with it although i don't know if a hydrating serum has to be that costly a cheaper alternative is this one it's again the swiss beauty tried and tested pearl glow serum hydrating brightening and smoothing i've only used this once i have it on right now because it came in today so i applied it right away and it's so nice it, it is also so pretty i don't know if it is visible on camera but there's this glitter layer swirling around the bottle it looks so pretty and magical it has a little more runnier consistency compared to this one but i think it still does the job so if you want a cheaper alternative i would recommend this one and if you're willing to invest this is really nice while i'm out here recommending serums this is another one that i really like this is the ordinary niacinamide 10% and zinc 1% serum this is more than just a hydrating serum i think you're supposed to use it twice every week at least that's how much i use it i also ordered the peeling solution serum from the ordinary which came in today i haven't really used it so i can't tell you how it is although i've heard good things about it and good things about the brand it's not to the most affordable side but at the same time i feel like it is it's not that costly and according to the price i think it's very much worth it so if you want to try another skincare brand the ordinary is really nice i would really recommend it especially this serum it's so nice i don't know about the peeling solution but if you want i can tell you about it later comment down below if you want to know about it Coming down below, the last product I want to talk about, I am not sure if it necessarily comes under skincare, but I think it can pass. It's a hand fan. So necessary during the summers. I have my fan off and my AC is not working. It's still not fixed. So this is working wonders for me right now. I don't want to stop. Again, just throw it in your tote bag. Take it out whenever you need it. And a nice refreshing air is what you'll receive okay i feel like i've talked for three hours now and i didn't have to go that much into detail about all these things but i like to run my mouth what can i say about it but moving on to the next category it's footwear i cannot tell you how often i wear these if you like them then this is everything you will need um I think these are the sandal type of shoes, but they're also platform. They give you the height. I got these from H&M. Actually, they were given to me by my sister. They're a hand-me-down. But these are from H&M and they are so nice and comfortable. These are a size small to me, but I still wear them and they are still so comfortable to me. And I, I love these. Another one I'd recommend are these. They are just these open sandals which have heels in them because... I need a little height okay but this is a very comfortable small heel so you can easily walk in them they're open you have the air coming in and going out it's comfortable it's chic it's pretty try experimenting with colors again if you want to and open sandals with a little heels like this these are cute another type of footwear are shoes but comfortable and cute shoes again these have fun colors in them to bring a little fun to the outfit uh, cool element to the outfit and yeah so cool comfy sports shoes like these 
best way to go. You cannot go wrong. Okay, well, moving on to the final category, which is also my favorite category, clothes. <laughs> that was very tiresome i'm very tired i think four or five hours have passed i don't know what time is it anymore i'm just really tired and done with this video can you tell by my voice i think it cracked a little bit but yeah i hope you had fun watching i hope you gained something out of it and it's summer go off have fun wear your favorite clothes be comfortable be fun be goofy with it play around with it and just make it yours. Make it your own. So that was all I have for you today. Next time you're going to see me, I'm going to have braces on. And I hope you don't think of me as a changed person. I know I've talked about this enough in the last video. I don't need to go on a fucking tangent again. But I'm really scared. I'm getting my braces tomorrow. So. Well, you don't care about it. I'm the one getting braces. Okay, you don't care. I'm going. Bye.